what's going on YouTube? John, Mike here, Dig That Beat. We are headed to a town. It's about an hour away. We've been here before. I got the cat bust on the sidewalk. We got in the yard and Mike, uh, what did you get in that yard, Mike? A silver thimble? Silver, yeah, thimble. Washington Quarter. We dug a Canadian silver. Yep. It's a pretty good yard, but the town is really, really old. But a lot of these homes here are just people's vacation homes. They don't come down too often. We could have got there quicker riding on the back of a turtle. <laughs> John drives so slow. I do, I drive slow. I do the speed limit, so not much <laughs> over. <laughs> Anyways, guys, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll pick it back up when we get on uh, get on site. All right, so we're, uh, I hope you like my hat. I know it's stupid, and I don't, I don't do hats, but I don't want to burn my head today. <laughs> it's going to be 90, so it's going to be hot. But we're on a little public spot here, and my first signal is this. I don't know what it is. Maybe you guys know. If you know what that is, drop it in the comments. Kind of cool piece, though. But Mike was digging a signal, too, his first signal. Look down there, we don't know what that is. It was shiny, though. You got some writing on it. I hope it's, I hope it's silver. Oh, it looks silver. Let's say Sheriff. Let's see. In Anderson County, Sheriff. Oh, my goodness. We're an hour and a half away. That's crazy. Can I rub it? The back? Yeah. That could be Sterling Mike. I don't know if it's plated, but dude, that is cool. That is cool, man. That is I like super it just cool. Just because we in a we, we way away and it's Anderson County. <laughs> <laughs> What's the odds? That's crazy. Good job, Thank Mike. You. You're welcome. All right, YouTube. We have dug four holes. The first two you've seen, the little item I asked for identification on. Mike got the junior deputy badge. I just dug a wee, and Mike's got silver. This spot may be killer. I hope so. We four signals. It. Four signals. We deserve it. All right, so let's see what Mike's got. There it is. Go ahead and get her, Mike. Looks like an old one, too. 36, I think. Correct. 36 Merc. Ooh. This could be good, Mike. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right. This is signal number five. It's going to be a little makeup compact. Glass is falling out of it. Check it out. Brass. Kind of busted up a little. That's crazy. Keep watching. All right, Mike walked over. I got a spiky high signal. I mean, and I've got a silver spoon bowl. I wish I could find the rest because it was very decorative. That's cool, man. Mike. I'm going to come over here and search for the rest of it. <laughs> Help me find it, dude. <laughs> I just got this really old toy car, it's about six inches deep. Got a good color to it still, which is crazy. Hey yes, sir. All right. <laughs> hey, we do it. Let me show you something I found. Sir? Let me show you something I found. We're going to talk to the sheriff. He said if we find a metal golf cup, okay. let him know. All right, right here, it's getting a deep, low 20s, but it actually is a 58 Rosie. Nothing fancy. I just wiped it off, 58D. I'll take it though. Thanks for watching. All right, YouTube, just come over me and might clean this token off. It's Baltimore, Baltimore Clothes, Inc. So some kind of clothing token. It's got a little hole. Somebody's probably wearing it on a necklace. And on the back it says Balto clothes, all wool, and fully guaranteed. That's a cool token. Brass. So I'm happy with that. I am too. Appreciate Amen. it, Mike. Amen. 
Yeah, you know, Mike's taking a water break. But so far, I mean, we've been here, what, Mike, an hour? Mm -hmm. This is my haul. I got two newer cars. This one's a 93 Hot Wheels. This is really cool. It's an old one. And I got this little latch or whatever, makeup compact. Token, Rosie, Silver Spoon Bowl, Four Wheats, and that clad, and there's the trash. So right now, really more good stuff than trash. Yeah. And that really. don't happen often. Yeah. Really Mine's doing really well. You got what, eight wheats and a Merc? Eight wheats and a Merc, yep. Yeah. So yeah. It's been a good one. Still got a lot left too. We yeah, haven't yeah. done it all, so yeah. I'm sure there's gonna be more. We're gonna grab lunch, cool off a little bit after we do this section, and uh we're going to an old house. And we're this... gonna tell you where we are. <laughs> <laughs> and the old house has been hunted before, so this hasn't, so we're definitely gonna finish this up before we go. Stay tuned. Mike walked up and uh he couldn't stand the fact that I got two pieces of silver and he's only That's got you, one. That's you, not me. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want out here in the heat. I'm over here in the shade. Good job, Mike. Still in situ. Let's see what it is. I know what it is. Murky down. I mean, you're. Right. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's Barber. Ain't no Barber. 40. Dude, this is a killer spot, man. Thank you, man. You're welcome. Memorial in this. Mike got another silver, guys. This could be a really good spot. He said it was hitting a little bit low, so it could be old. What do you think, Mike? Breaker out. I know what it is already. Merc. Nope. You two be honest what it is. Huh? Rosie. Well, I ain't got one yet, so no. I'll take it. Looks like a 48 or 49. Like good it. job, man. Dirt and all, you can have it. What? <laughs> Was just getting a 32 here, and I've got a 1971 Kennedy half dollar. Just missed that 40 percenter by I think might said a year. Oh, maybe next time I'll still take it though. Keep watching. Ever had a good deep high tone, and you can see right here in the bottom, I got silver again. I think it's gonna be another rosy. It is. Let's see what we got. Ooh, 62, just a baby, but it's 9% silver. Good day. Thanks, Mike. Just walked over in the shade here, but I'll show you. I got a thimble. You don't know how long I've been looking for silver. This is going to be one of the aluminum advertising pieces. Probably insurance related, most of them are. Aluminum thimble. Yeah, I'll, I'll take it. Keep watching, guys. Just had another screaming signal, and I've got a bicentennial half dollar Kennedy. It's crazy. You never find clad halves, and I've already got two of them. A good clean signal about three or four inches go right out of the bottom of the plug keep watching I'm walking up to Mike. He's got something. We're about to go to lunch. Oh, he's got a general service eagle button. It's gonna come off a coat, probably World War One, maybe two. I'm not sure. This area here, anything from the 20s through the 40s. So we don't know how to date them, but it's definitely a general service button. And it's cool. I ain't dug one in a while. It is cool, man. Good job, Mike. Hey, Let's go get some food, man. All right.
watching Mike semi-live dig. Just popped a plug on a really good high tone. He's already dug a couple wheats right here. Come on, Mike. Uh-oh. Show me shiny. Is that a token? Be a token. That'd be something. What is that? Another button. Another eagle button. Isn't that crazy? Five he's just talking. Ten feet that way. Just talking. Saying I hadn't done many of these, and now he's already got two. It's crazy. Two clad halves, two eagle buttons. This one still has a. This has something attached to the back. Iron. Yep. That's why it was kind of spiky. But it was down. So yeah. Yeah. Good job, Mike. Thank you, bud. Dude, this has been a phenomenal little public area just in the middle of a little neighborhood. Still got a lot to go to. And the sheriff talked to us, or the police, a police officer. He actually lives right here. He's really cool. And uh, checked down what we was finding, and said he's got an old golf cup out here somewhere that has over time been buried so if we find that we're gonna let them know that's right let's do it mike Ooh. all right just got a deep high tone and got one of these little smashed pennies but i think this one actually went through the machine so probably not terribly old but a uh, neat find keep watching guys All right, YouTube, we're destroying the wheats. You can see Mike over there working. Mike, how many wheats you on? 17. 17. I got to be at least in the 12 range, and I was going to record this one. It was just a perfect flip with the plug. There's the imprint. There's the coin. And uh, we're going to keep on trucking. 18. 18? Yeah. <laughs> There's wheats everywhere. And we've already got five silver coins, silver spoon, ton of relics. I mean, this is just a phenomenal spot. Keep watching, guys. Stay here with you. That's a merc. <laughs> is it? Mike's walking up. I've got a silver. It is a Merc, Mike. I told you, man. I don't lie. 1918. You lied. I'm not lying. It's old. So we. Man, dude, man. we got to have a combined 30 wheats. Yep. Um, silver oh, spoon. Five, five, six silver dimes? You got uh, five how dimes and uh, one silver spoon. Half bowl. I don't know if we're gonna make it to the old house. We may have to come back next weekend. We're, we're gonna try. We're gonna try. At least see, see if it's worth happens. coming back to. Yeah. Yeah. The lady's super nice. I texted her and told her that we may be a little bit. Plus, there's an old Boy Scout camp down there. Yeah. We haven't checked it out yet. We just talked with the uh, officer there for about 20 minutes. Super cool guy. So yeah, let's keep going, Mike. All right. So I just dug a low 20 signal and I got me a general service eagle button, but mine's a cuff. So yeah, it's pretty cool. Keep watching. All right, come over here in the shade. It is really hot and we're digging a crap ton of signals, but uh, I was coming across through there and got a six, seven inch spiking 28 to 30 and uh, I popped out a 1954 Roosevelt dime and no mint Philadelphia so I'll take it silver dime number four on the day I know Mike's got three silver spoon over 30 wheats all kinds of relics just a an excellent place to hunt we're having a blast keep watching Mike walking up to me I'm in the shade taking a little water break He's gonna have a old key plate skeleton key. Yep. Cool, cool relic. All kind of different stuff. Good job, Mike. Thank you, bud. What you about to do? Get you something to drink too? That's right. It's hot, hot man. They made three lines. What? Like you say 91? 90, 91. Easy. What? The weather. Oh, yeah, definitely. Low 90s. Yes, it's hot. And if y'all look, he's in the shade. Yeah, I got lucky. Now I'm in the sun. So this is kind of funny how it's worked. We started off this morning, and I was on the other side of that telephone pole. That was gonna be my half. And Mike got a wheat on this side of the pole. And as I come across, the lady that lives here come out talking to me. So I crossed over. And as I start to go back to Tech, then Mike had already kind of crossed over my way. And I got a good signal. It turned out being that silver spoon bowl. So we've just stuck to these two halves the rest so of the day. What trying to say is he stole my silver bowl. You come to my side first. <laughs> <laughs> no, we, we bounce around each other. Yeah, we do, man. He's about to help me finish up my side because I'm going a little bit slower today. Pace. Good job, Mike. Guys, I'm telling you, the sun's beating us. But I'm sitting down beside Mike. I just got a 30 signal. It was spiking. It was real wonky. It didn't sound like a coin. 
I'll show you. Excuse me, what I got? I got a silver ring. Looks old. Let's pop, bust it out here. Looks smaller like a kid's. There it is. I'm shaking because I'm so hot. Me too. It's miserable. It's a light here. Pop that out, mate. Oh, tell me what we got. Good God. It's like a rock. We need some moisture in the ground. Should be stamped sterling. That's the older one. Whew. What you got, Mike? Tell me something good. Oh, freak. It's aluminum. Aluminum. <laughs> yeah. Sterling right there, boy. Sterling. Yep. Real nice. Stamped in there. I meant you I don't like you. <laughs> you did about five times. <laughs> Thanks, Mike. Thanks. All right, just got a 34 right here. Didn't live dig it, but it's big. It could be quarter half. It looks like a half though. Let me pull it back. It's in the bottom of this hole. Hmm. See it? Yep. God. I can't. Sorry guys. Quarter, Never mind. I got excited. 42. Oh. I thought it was a half. It was hitting 34. We ain't hit a quarter yet. But I'll take a quarter. Good. Thanks Mike. Good job. Oh, Mike, that's big, dude. Yeah, that's a quarter, probably. I'm walking up to Mike. Looks like he's got at least a quarter. Flip it. Boom, yeah. Boom, yeah. 32. 32, you wish. Had to be a D, too. 50? 50. Mike, let's keep killing it, dude. Thank you, dude. Congratulations. It's been a good day. It has been a good day. Mike, is it I hot? I started off doing good. We, you doing good still. And uh, John's killing me. Not by much though, man. It's been back and forth all day. But I did just get a 27. Thought I had a maybe a silver dime under this tree and look at that big old thick sterling bracelet. Let's see if we can get it out, Mike. There we go. I don't know, bracelet could be plated, but I think this right here is silver actually. It's got a name on it. Harry? See if that says silver, Mike. I'm shaking. It hit like silver. The heat is getting us. Does that say silver down the there towards back, your the left back, hand? The back looks stainless. Maybe stainless, man. I mean, I got it sided for nothing. I think, it, I think it's stainless. See stainless? The shine? Yeah, I do. Now that, on the other hand, may be. No, see the flicking? Is it? Yes, yeah, plated. Boy, it sounded good. I thought I had a good one. Good job, dude. All right, we're going to keep going, guys. Keep watching. All right, we're at the 1820s house. Um, it's been picked over, hardly no high tones or low tones, hardly no signals, but I finally got a solid 12 and dug us a toy knife. But uh, we're just trying to kill a little bit more time before we go home. We've already had a killer day. Yeah, that's so yeah, we're gonna keep going. Maybe we're gonna hit a high tone here in a minute, be something good. Keep watching. All right, I'm standing here with Mike. He's wiping on what I just found. Signals are slow. We've got a few pieces of clad. Um, Nothing old until this. It was hitting around the Indian. That's why I dug it. How's it going, man? Sterling right there. Yeah. And then I just got this. Homeowner's gonna come down and talk to us, but it's sterling. I don't know what it is, but I'll update you. All right, YouTube, we're finished. Head tired, completely exhausted. It's been a long day. What? Huh? What is it? There's that place. Oh, the signs. Yeah. Mike's looking at these old signs. Yeah, I didn't know what he was trying to signal me. I was like, what is he signaling, signaling me? Uh, he already got me uh, trying to give me some kind of code. I didn't know what he was doing. I'll cut it out, Fat Jim. Keep, uh, keep on going. Okay. Keep on going. All right. So, yeah, we uh, we had a good day. I mean, we absolutely destroyed coins and relics at that little uh, public spot that we went to. Um, went to the old 1820s house, and we did find out that it gets hunted often. But there's still some stuff out there. It's just going to be a lot of work to find it. And we're completely exhausted. So we talked with the homeowners, and they're cool with us coming back. I did get that one little sterling piece at the end. But uh, overall, man, it was a good day. Yeah. Yeah. Thankfully, my detector died. <laughs> and let us give us a reason to go home. Yeah. It's kind of funny. You know, the only way we can tell our detectors apart is we got the detect shafts. Mine is the 
red belly black and mine's the 3k twill the black one well last time when we detected i got his detector instead of mine we somehow swapped them up but for some reason his detector it stayed on charge all night last night at my house but no, it didn't but it didn't I charge charged his and he forgot to charge mine no, i charged it i promise <laughs> but all the way over here today it's about an hour and 10 minutes we kept it in the you know on the car charger and it charged up enough to last till right at the end so it was kind of thankful it died because we were really really tired but uh give us a reason to start heading home yep got but, that right but as always guys thanks for watching we appreciate it we uh thank y'all for the comments and everything you do for the channel and uh make sure you give this video a thumbs up make sure you subscribe to the channel turn on the bell for notifications peace yeah.